G'day everyone, Dicko here with another kick-ass walkthrough. So, over the past year or so of creating this channel and teaching in the real world, I've started to notice a couple of patterns. One, newbies always seem to make the same mistakes. Two, they always run into the same frustrations. And three, they don't know why they do it. Particularly when it comes to working within a specific software. Either they get roped up in all the cool new features that come with any given release, or they have been introduced to certain tools too early in their learning that leads to the development of bad habits when creating 3D art, which in the long run leads to frustrations they face when they want to jump into the next stage of their development. A good example of this is being able to jump from modeling something to texturing something. Now this isn't isolated to any given software, Blender, Maya, C3D, 3ds Max, you see the same mistakes happening over and over again. For example, using booleans to the point where the mesh completely breaks when they try to subdivide it, or not understanding that object history and transforms matter, or creating a triangle-ridden mess of a mesh so that when it comes to UV mapping, they're presented with a nightmare task. So I want to fix that. I want to boil down the method down to the basics, and I want to make it as simple as possible, but also as software agnostic as possible. So with whatever you use to make art, you can follow these methods and know that they'll work. And to prove it, I'll be using both Blender and Maya to prove my point. So whether you're a student in college who has access to the fancy pants quote unquote industry standard software, or someone who is at home and just wants to learn what they can with whatever they can access, then hopefully this series will be great for you, both of you. That being said, you should be familiar with the general UI conventions of any given app you're going to use. This is not baby's first 3D lesson. You should at least have a grasp of the fundamentals, navigation, menu systems, and general conventions of the software you want to use. Though I'll be sure to point out any relatively egregious features if that's worth bringing up. So I guess the first question that you might be asking is, what the hell are we going to make? Well, if you're watching what's on the screen right now, you'll see me sketching up a cute little medieval tavern and this will be available in the comments below for you to download and you can follow along as you see fit or you can make your own sketch and use that. So without further ado, let's jump into this shit, shall we?